everybody. Yay! Wow, it's, it's really exciting to see so many people out here. This is awesome. Um, I am, uh, uh, it's great that people are out here, but I'm really concerned because there's a huge assault, not just against public education, but against public workers in general. Yep. I'm excited because it's time for us to fight back and go on the offensive. We got, we got the uh, OUS system that almost went out on strike. We got bargaining going on in Mount Hood. Everyone here knows about what's going on with the Portland Public Schools, and I think Gwen is going to be speaking in a second about what's going on there. But we need to come together, fight not just around public education and, and the teachers and all these fights, but get ready for next year when they bring the assault on all public employees in Oregon with their so-called right to work for less. I'm not even supposed to say right to work. But it's going to really be the fight for our lives next year. So let's let's kick some ass here today and go on the offensive next year. Just a couple things. I want to uh, give a really exciting presentation with a bunch of numbers. The numbers are 8, 65, and 47. I bet most of you know what those are about, but, but for, for those of you who don't, 8%, that's the cut they want to make, right? Yeah. 40, 47 is uh, where, where Oregon ranks of the 50 states in terms of student funding for education. Yeah. 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 Those are the bad numbers. 65%, that's a great number because that's how much administrative bloat has gone up at ESU. Yeah. 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 Those numbers don't add up to me. No. So I'm so glad you're fighting back. But I want to shut up. I have a really exciting guest I want to introduce. Um, John Boo Justice, we're, we're a coalition. We are about bringing fights together. We're a, we're a coalition of over 95 organizations. That's why we're going to be out there at Walmart on Black Friday at 11 a.m. Yeah. So we're going to say the Walmart faculty. So I want to see a lot of the Walmart faculty out at the Walmart on 82nd on Black Friday. And I also want everybody to come together to support the PAT. We're going to hear from Gwen in a minute. But the PAT is in a huge fight, and they're having a big rally on this coming Friday. They're going to take, just like we took over the bridge here, they're going to take over the Burnside Bridge on Friday afternoon. Yeah. 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 So join with the PAT on Friday, 4, 4.15 at the Boston Nova Ballroom, 4.30 beyond the bridge to support them. But real quickly, we have a really exciting special guest here. Uh, Francisca is the president of the National Teachers Union of El Salvador. Oh. Um, yeah. I've been to El Salvador a bunch of times. They have great stuff going on. The national, the university there in El Salvador has been at the heart of every struggle in El Salvador, and there's a lot of struggles going on in El Salvador. Um, so, Francisca Iriheta, the president of Andes Union of El Salvador. And, uh, translate. I'm just a translator. Hello to everybody for being here. Thank you for being here. Felicitarles por esta lucha que están políticas neoliberales a nuestros pueblos como El Salvador. It's great what you guys are doing. It's helping out being here. Is what we're also doing in our pueblos in El Salvador. Por eso es muy importante estar organizados tanto estudiantes como trabajadores de la educación. It's very important that students, like employees and faculty, are involved together. Así es como en nuestros pueblos hemos podido lograr muchas conquistas de represión contra nuestra clase trabajadora. Maestros, maestras, estudiantes y toda la población pobre que vive en El Salvador. That's how we've been able to achieve success with pueblos, in pueblos, with faculty and staff together. That's how we've been able to make this happen. Veo que los problemas no son ajenos, que tanto maestros y maestras, estudiantes y estudiantes a nivel mundial nos une la misma lucha y la misma causa. These problems are not individual, they are shared around the world. We all have this problem around the world, in schools, everywhere. We're all sharing the same problems, people. Yeah.
solamente decirles, sigan adelante, logren las conquistas y solo unidos y luchando van a lograrlo. Everybody together, doing this together, uniting is how we're going to win this to make things happen. So don't give up, keep on going together. Por un mejor presupuesto y una mejor atención en la educación pública. For a better proposition and a better use of education together. A luchar unidos y unidas. Everyone together, men, women, united. Muchas gracias, compañera. Thank you very much. Basic message. We stand united. We stand united. We will not be divided. Faculty and students will not be divided. And your and fixed term will not be divided. SEIU and PSUFA will not be divided. We stand united. With Portland teachers, we stand united. Here we have Gwen Sullivan. Yeah. Hello there. My name is Gwen Sullivan, and I am the president of Portland Association of Teachers. Yeah. And believe it or not, I'm actually a teacher. I was elected by my uh, all the members to represent teachers, and that is my job. Right. And so representing teachers really means, in this contract battle, what we've been fighting for is the schools our students deserve. And I know that that's what you are fighting for. As I, as I stand up here, what I look around and I see people, I feel like I'm looking in the mirror. We are dealing with the same thing. That's right. When right. we're hearing about transparency, lo and behold, that's what we're asking for, some transparency. Yeah. Our district is paying $15,000 a month to a consultant to bring down the teachers. that is beautiful. It is about public education <coughs> and educating our youth. Yeah. Right. We want to educate our youth in a way to question what is being force fed to them. And I think it is our job to make sure that we continue to properly educate our youth. That's right. right.
rally on the on the bridge, the Burnside Bridge. It's between 4:30 and 5:30. We plan on lining up the whole bridge. Afterwards, we're going to be at the Bossa Nova Ballroom. Please come, have some pizza and some fun. We need to get to know each other because the education doesn't just uh, start in elementary; it continues on and throughout our whole lives. We need to make sure that the citizens that we're raising today are questioning tomorrow's future. Thank you. Do not give up. We are together. Yay!